It's me. It's me. It's Driver 53. Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Tony Stewart's All-American Racing. And y'all, we've got a special paint job here today for a special race. That's right. It's another showdown. Let's get into it. All right, everybody, we're going to Straight River in Nebraska. It's a third mile track. It's going to be a 20 lap main event, and the purse is $16,500. I've got to get a top 30 to get my bonus from my sponsor. So let's go. All right, here we go. So if y'all don't remember, this is where we had our first showcase, the one where I jumped in the car for the very first night, or the very first time that first night. So we already know the track a little bit. We've got to get a 16-4. That's what we got to try and get. So I loosened the car up a little bit more this time than what we had it last time to help out with a little bit of rotation. So as long as I can keep it off the wall coming out, I think I should be pretty good just staying down here on the bottom. Ooh, 16-8. We're close. As long as I can keep it out of the wall, I think we'll be all right. 16-4-1-4. That's what we need. Oh, wow. So how did I gain on him coming off the corner? He was catching me so well. I guess I must have just had a really good corner. But here we go. Not about myself now. 16-4-1-4. Let's do this. What are we going to get? What are we going to get? 16,251. All right, as long as I can stay pretty close to this line, I think I'll be all right. Let's see what this next one is. That'll be a better indication. 16,9. So what happens when I come all the way down here? Is it going to, like, nerf me? Sixteen eight, not great. So I think like halfway in between. I think when I get too far down there, yeah, I'm not gaining anything because I'm not in the the groove, you know, the moisture groove. So I need to be like right in here. The back tire is right on around that white line. If not, just a little bit above. Alright, so I think I can... Oh, wow. Alright, let's just go ahead and take it to the shop, the garage, real quick. It's go time. Do the best you can. Alright, everybody, here we are. We got two laps of qualifying. I went ahead and just jumped right into it. I'm not going to get much more out of this car. So we're just going to go ahead and jump in here and see uh, see what it'll give us. So we'll try and run right around the bottom like I was there in practice. I don't want to get I don't want to get too far down on the inside this first lap at least, just to see what we can get out of this thing. I'm gonna hug this white line. There's a couple bumps there that are a little bit upsetting, but I think I'm going up over them okay. All right, we're gonna try it, y'all. See if we can get a good runoff. Qualifying is done for the day. Nope. Well, the good news is there's 60 cars here, and I start heat three in sixth place. That's pretty good. Let's see how many it takes to get up into the A main once we get into it. The top two move on to the dash. They're coming to the line. And we're underway. The green is flying. All right, y'all. We are here to get 
into the top three. Let's just stick around this bottom right here and see what we do. We got five laps to get this done. These are some fast cars. Let's see what we can do. And they're pulling away from me a little bit. All right, we're in fifth place right now. Hanging out here on the bottom. They're going to have to pass me on the high side if they want to round me. Three laps to go. Still sitting in fifth place. This is pretty nice. Looks like we've got a couple challenges here. Oh, how did he pass me just so easily on the outside like that? Wow. I think six will put me in the B main. One more lap. Let's just hang on. Let's see if we can make it into the B main. No, come on. Do not let these guys get underneath you. Do not. Do not. Hold these guys up at all costs. Let's go. Let's go. Hope you all enjoyed that one. Oh, sixth place, y'all. C, C main. What? Oh, man. All right, C main starting third. That's not bad. That's not bad. All right, here we go. Welcome to the C main, where the top five finishers advance to the B main and stay alive. <clears throat> Drivers are coming to the line. Here we go. And here we go. The green is out. All right, y'all. Here we go. I've got ten laps to stay ahead of some drivers or maybe get up here and do uh, first place I don't know Let's see what we can do I would love to finish first in this thing there we go All that work in one corner can just go poof. You gotta be on it ten tenths of the time, ten laps. Ten, ten, ten. Holy cow. I feel like I'm holding these guys up quite a bit. I mean, with a slower car, that's kind of what you expect, right? So, we're halfway through almost. Yeah? One guy opens the door, and two other ones come flying through. We're going to have to get one of these back. Let's get in here. There we go. Let's get this guy, too. Let him know that we are not happy about what he did. There we go. Great lap time. That was actually really, really good laps. So. I guess when you're motivated, you kind of buckle down and do what you need to, right? This showcase race has it all. Amazing talent, drivers on the edge, and white knuckle racing. As long as they stay down here on the bottom, I should be good. Oh. Y'all, I'm driving this like it's an A main and it's only a C. What am I going to do in the B? This is intense. This is super intense. I got to stay ahead of those guys. There's a big group of them all right here. Oh, man. Can I, I want to stay in second so bad. So bad. I think I got it, y'all. I think I got it. What a fantastic performance for all of the top five tonight. What an oh. awesome race. That's awesome. 
I'm going to the B main starting 14th. Now I don't know how I'm gonna do in that, but I'm going to the B main, y'all. That is awesome. Welcome to the B main. The last chance to make the dance. We're looking for five cars to complete our feature field. Listen to those engines as we get ready to go. The green flag is in here. All right, y'all. Here we go. We are not going to be taking this uh, lightly. We got 10 laps to get up here in the top five. I'm going to do everything in my power to do that. I'm not going to let anybody back by me on the inside. Come on now. Let's get some laps going. I just don't have enough power. What a lap that was, folks. Holy cow. These guys are fast. Like lightning fast in a bottle. There we go. That driver is flying around this track. There's that little bump again. All right, we're in 11, let's get to 10. And we only got two laps to go. Only two laps to go, folks. Let's get it. Come on. Get that number nine, get Jackson. The white flag is out, we're going to go. I can't really do a send it here because the corner's so long, you're in it for so much longer than you are that last track we did that on. So I think I'm just, I'm going to be in 11th place here. I wish I could have sent it. What a race. There is a ton of talent throughout the field, and I'm excited to see what they do in the next race. All right, everybody. We barely, barely did it. We got 29th place. Oh, that is, that is, that's nice. That's nice. <laughs> All right. So, looks like we're up to 25th now in the season standings, and Tony Stewart, once again, comes in, steals the show. All right, let's check out our financials from this. So, we won $7,692 from the race payout. We got $24.13 from our sponsor. We got $275 from the merch, and $614 from practice goal. We made $10,994. That is awesome. Let's go. All right, so apparently I've got a new best buddy, Jeffrey Carter and Seth Ingebright, get along on and off the track. It's kind of weird how newspapers putting that out about me and somebody else. Let's see what this ties into. All right, everybody, it looks like I've got the option to get a manager now. Mr. Calvin Walsh has offered his uh, professional assistance, guidance, to help run my teams efficient, efficiently through uh, business negotiations and promotions. Looks like I get a 2.5% sponsor goal bonus. Nothing on merch right now. How's it going, Calvin? All right, y'all, what do you think? Should I go with normal here or easy? 
I think as long as I can make it into the A main three times, then I'm alright, right? Yeah, let's do that. Definitely let's do that. Alright, everybody. I want to make sure that I can get there, so I'm thinking about buying some new tires. Let's take a look and see what we got. So, I can spend some money and get these high precision tires. Um, they're 13,000. That would leave me about seven. That's enough for my repairs. Durability on them is really good, so I'm not going to have to replace or repair them as often. Um, I don't know. Or I can go here. Same performance, or one less performance, but I'm having to repair them more often, which I'm okay with. I don't think that's a bad thing. Um, but I'm going to save like $8,000 that I could maybe go get something else. So... I think, honestly, this is what I want to do. Because I could come over here, but I really want to get some uh, durability out of it also. So, I think I'm not worried about repairing stuff. As long as I can get my performance up, then the repair bills will be fine. Um, so, I think I'm going to go and purchase these tires. For sure. Purchase and equipped. Awesome. So I wonder if I could sell these. <gasps> I could sell these. Ooh, how much do I make? I make $243. Let's just sell it. I don't need them anymore. Perfect. And let's sell these. I get 593 Absolutely awesome. You know what? Let's go and do that to do some other stuff too, maybe. Alright, so we got 16663 What about a motor? How much is that going to run us? Ooh, 22. Okay, we can't do that yet. Um, so, chassis or suspension? What do you guys think? Let's go chassis. 12. Okay. And this one is 10. So we're going to get the same performance. I say let's go with chassis first. So we're going to purchase and equip. Perfect. We're going to come back over here and we're actually going to sell this. We're going to make $15.53. Great. And this one here, same thing. Sell it. $5.76. Not bad. Alright, so now we're back at $6,072. So really quickly, I want to come down here and I want to sell this. We made $4.65. Perfect. Now, let's go back up here and let's sell this. I don't think we're going to get much out of it, but just to see. 193. Sell. All right, perfect. So we're at 7630. I don't think that is enough to do anything. No, we need 10. All right, so what we're going to do, let's go ahead and repair this. Repair. Perfect. And repair. Perfect. So we've still got six, seven, eight, nine. I couldn't do that again if I tried. And 2012, 2012. That was a pretty good movie if you guys remember that. So, yeah, we're up to 26% now on our uh, 26 points on our performance, which is 22% upgraded. We're at 15% overall durability. That's pretty good. I mean, I think that's pretty good. All right, everybody, that's going to be the end of today's episode. I I had a good time in the showcase. I know that those drivers have top-of-the-line cars that are fully maxed out on all the equipment. We're still getting there. To finish in 29th place like we did, I feel pretty good. Um, you know, we made it up into the B main, and we finished in what, 14th or something like that. So I feel good. I really do. I... Uh, I'm excited. We were able to spend some money on some other performance stuff. So now we're up at 26. Um, we increased quite a bit in the performance field. So we should be good to go for this next few races. You know, with our sponsor, we got to get top 25s. So that's another reason why I did that. Kind of wanted to push myself a little bit. You know, instead of sitting back and letting everything just kind of fall into place a little bit more natural, I kind of wanted to push myself and get up there. So. I'm looking forward to it. I think it's going to be great. And 
like I said, this is the end. So, if you enjoyed what you saw today, give me a thumbs up. If you didn't enjoy it, give me a thumbs down. I can take it. If you want to leave a comment below, go right ahead. You know, the more comments I have, the more feedback, obviously, and it lets me know that you guys are interested in this content. I'll look at every single, every single one of them. Uh, it may take me a bit to respond because I do have other content that I'm putting out too. Um, and it's this dirt racing isn't my primary content. This is secondary. I'm doing it. I enjoy it, and I want to see if I can build this side of my channel also. So, um, if you would share, share with anybody that you think would really enjoy this content. Um, like I said, the more people we have, the more I know what I need to do to to make better stuff that you guys are actually going to enjoy. And you may be enjoying it now, but can I improve? If I can, give me a comment. Let me know. And until next time, everybody. This is Driver 53, signing off.